What's up guys, so a really quick video I just wanted to share with you. I'm aware that this is a first world problem and there are many bigger problems in the world, but it was quite frustrating. Very recently, I tried to buy a Scott bike. Now, Scott sell this bike, it's called the Scott Addict Gravel 10. So Scott sell this bike, it's called the Gravel Addict 10. I'll show it to you now. This is one of the best looking bikes I've ever seen. It's a gravel bike and it is one of the best looking gravel bikes on the market, I think. It's just the dogs like to look at. Anyway, I had my heart set on buying this gravel bike. The problem is, this gravel bike was out of stock absolutely everywhere. I know it also might be a little early for a 2023 bike, but I also checked the 2022 bike and they are also not in stock anywhere. I checked valve bike, checked uh, wheelbase, everywhere that sells Scott in the UK, it was out of stock. I was just unable to buy it. I wanted it in a 54, thought I'd go down a size and I could not find it anywhere. I actually ended up ringing a Scott dealer. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you the name of the bike shop, but I rung a Scott dealer and they told me that they've basically given up trying to sell Scott bikes because they just can't get them in and people get frustrated and we're waiting for so long, so people cancel their orders, so they've actually just stopped trying to sell Scott bike. So the only reason I'm posting this video is because I just want to know a bit more information if anyone has anything about why it's so difficult to buy bikes still. Um, it almost begs the question about whether this company actually wants to sell its bikes here. I mean, obviously we've had a lot of economic changes over the last few years, I mean, without getting into Brexit and this and that, like, is it just not feasible for companies to sell their bikes here? I mean, you would think the UK is quite a big market, but yeah, anyway, I could not buy this Scott bike. I mean, I think I could pre-order it from somewhere. I think I could pre-order it from one place, but it was the wrong size. It was a 56, which essentially would have been okay, but I wanted it in a 54. And I think it was like end of August before it was even being shipped. So, so yeah, I just thought I'd let everyone know. So I've actually bought another bike. Um, I bought a British manufacturer. Um, which is coming at the end of June, which I'm looking forward to. So yeah, if anyone else has had any problems like this or has had trouble buying a bike, um, just let me know. Because obviously they've lost a customer um, or a potential customer. And I just think it's quite an interesting thing really. But yeah, anyway, that's it. Peace.